Thank you. We are in the heart of Hurstville, in the middle, I think, of the most vibrant Chinese Australian community anywhere in Australia. Uh, talking to our local community, we have uh, Senator uh, uh, Jenny McAllister uh, from New South Wales, the member for Barton, Mid the Burnie, and, and wonderful community representative Ben, Jenny, Jason, and everybody's here to support our wonderful Chinese Australian community. And the message really from the heart of Hurstville is that it is open for business. Restaurants are serving some of the best food you will have, not just in Australia, but anywhere in the world. And many of them are full. So uh, a lot of people that live, work, um, reside, study, whatever in this part of Sydney are getting out of their houses, even on wet, rainy days like today, and partaking in some of the best food you will ever have. So. It's a reminder, I think, to our local community. Don't forget, come out, patronise your local restaurants, uh, eat some of this food, talk to your local community, convince your neighbours to come out, tell your family, tell your friends, tell grandma, grandpa. Uh, today is the day that we're going to leave the house and have a wonderful meal in Hurstville in this wonderful part of Sydney. Yeah. And with that, yeah. all right. <laughs> and with that, I think I'll throw it over to Jenny. Oh, thanks, Chris. Look, it's wonderful to be here in Hurstville uh, with good friends and terrific community leaders. We have had a terrific meal uh, talking with one another about some of the challenges that are facing Chinese Australians and the Chinese Australian community at the moment. With the coronavirus, it is actually a difficult time and it's a really important day for us to be here and show some solidarity. There are a lot of Chinese Australians for a range of reasons feeling a little uncertain and it's incredibly important that as a community we pull together and give this community our support. I will say that in talking to some of the leaders here we've heard some pretty disturbing stories about people behaving in racist ways. This is a disease which is, is, does not discriminate and we ought not discriminate either. This is a time for us to stand very firm uh, as, a, as a proud multicultural nation supporting Chinese Australians at a time when we are all dealing with something quite challenging globally and it's been terrific to be here uh, with good friends and to hear their very wise perspectives on how we can best support this community. I want to really acknowledge the Chinese community uh, for welcoming us here today, uh, for telling us what the effects of the coronavirus is having not only on business but also on children in schools and the most important thing the most important message is look at official channels read official information do not believe some of the sensational uh, stories that we are seeing on social media we are here for the chinese community